This is the Hopewell Earthworks episode of the Ohio Historical Society's Windows to Our Collections, Ohio's Ancient Past podcast series. You should be outside of the exhibit entrance at the bottom of the ramp. The earthwork models are to your left. We're standing here uh, in some large diorama areas just outside the Ohio Centuries of Change exhibit. These uh, large scale uh, three dimensional models present some of the most famous of the Hopewell earthworks uh, sites constructed by these people between about 100 BC and 500 AD. They give a marvelous sense of the form of the earthwork and how it's situated in the landscape. The Hopewell Mound Group in Ross County is probably one of the most famous of these sites, uh, in part because the Hopewell culture is named for it. Uh, excavations over a number of years uh, done by archaeologists uh, in various mounds in the Hopewell Mound Group have uh, produced a large number of some of the most spectacular art uh, made by these people. Many of the Hopewell artifacts in the windows to our collection exhibit are from this particular site. The Fort Ancient Earthwork is an example, and the best example at that, of a hilltop enclosure. Hilltop enclosures are walls made of earth and stone that enclose the top of a hill or a bluff, and the form of the earthwork in this case is determined more by the shape of the hill than by an abstract geometrical form. The Sipe Earthworks is in Ross County along Paint Creek. It's an example of a geometric enclosure. Uh, with portions consisting of simple geometric shapes such as the circles and square. The large loaf-shaped mound at the center of the large circle is Site Mound. Site Mound was excavated by the Ohio Historical Society in the 1920s and it revealed a large wooden structure at the base of the mound, um, sometimes called a big house, and this must have been the focus for ritual activities at this site for many years but at some point when the rituals had ended, the house was dismantled or to torn down and the large mound built over the top of it. The uh, monumental earth and architecture of the Hopewell culture is unique uh, in its uh, scope and in it, and its geometric precision. Uh, and it's evident too that some of these earthworks were aligned to movements of the sun and the moon. Well, that bringing together of the, the heavens and the earth are probably one of the strongest evidences that these places were ceremonial in nature and that people came from hundreds of miles around to, to visit these sites and to participate in the rituals. And people are still coming there even in the 21st century. That's right.